out here to test the Baja because we got a competition next week in Peoria, Illinois. It's an international competition. There's about 97 different countries, I believe. That's correct. Um, we've been competing since 2003, but the last two years are the first years that we've done it consecutively. The students design, build, and test the car. Everything is their own design, their own um, calculations, everything. The competition requires everyone to have a 10 horsepower Briggs and Stratton engine and um, they're not allowed to modify it in any way. When we get to competition, they set everybody so they're exactly the same. Okay. So the idea is that the students have to work on the rest of the suspension and the drivetrain to get whatever performance they're going to get out of it. The students have been working on this car since June of last year. Um, they started design at that point. We started fabrication in December and they were done in March so we've been testing more or less since March and fixing all the little parts. Part of the competition is they're required to have fire retardant suits on, on um, at all times and safety equipment. They have a helmet, goggles, gloves, arm restraints that keep their arms inside the vehicle, seat belts, the, let's see, they wear hands in the top, they have driver's suit, shoes, but those aren't required. Um, and neck brace to make sure that um, that it seals in between the suit and the helmet. It's fun, you know, it's a, it's a pretty rigorous course. Uh, we probably need a little bit more speed for the course that it's, you know, it's designed for a little bit more speed, mainly. Uh, but our suspension's holding up pretty well. I mean, it's, you can't even feel the jumps. Hopefully top 10, you know, I feel disappointed if we made anything less than top 20.